Hello students! So today we are going to learn how to use Quizlet to study for English. For this video we are going to use grade 4 lesson 1. My name is Eric. So you're gonna go over here and these are the tools you can use to study. You will see flashcards, learn, write, spell, and test. And down here are the games you can play, match, or gravity. So to study with flashcards, you're going to let's do full screen. And you're going to see it in Korean or English. Right, I'm going to change my options and answer with Korean. So here it is. My name is Eric. My name is Eric. My name is Eric. You're going to click here to see it in Korean. And if you want to hear it, you can click here. 내 이름은 에릭이야. You can hear it again. 내 이름은 에릭이야. Alright, so after you're done, you're going to... You can hear it in English, too. My name is Eric. And again. My name is Eric. Good, so after you finish, listen and repeat, you go to the next one. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? So you can listen to it again. What's your name? What's your name? And then you're going to click here to see it in Korean. You can listen to it in Korean. 이름이 뭐야? 이름이 뭐야? Yeah, so then you can go to the next one. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And then you can hear it again. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And then you can click to the Korean one. 만나서 반갑습니다. 만나서 반갑습니다. Yeah, so then after you are finished with that, you don't want to do flashcards anymore, you can go back. Just exit. You don't have an account. Go back. And now you can do learn the circle thing and click learn. What can you do in learn? So you can select the answer choices. This is, this reads, this is my father. This is my father. This is my father. So is it number one, number two, number three? Or number four. Correct is number three. So you get it right. It'd be green. Next one said, This is my friend. This is my friend. This is my friend. So will you choose number one, two, three, or four? Correct. Number three. Good job. Okay, and this one is name. Name. So is it number one, two, three, or four? Correct, it is number one. So if you don't want to read it in English, you can go to option and change it to answer with Korean or English. You can choose both or you just want one. We're going to do both this time, and yes. 만나서 반갑습니다. So if you click on it, it will read it to you. 만나서 반갑습니다. So is that number one, number two, number three, or number four? It is number one. Good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And you can click on 어머니. it. 어머니. Right, so is it number one, two, three, or four? Do, 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 do. Number three. Good job. It's mother. Mother. 
Okay, so now when you're after that, you're finished, you don't want to do that anymore, you can go back and now you're going to learn how to write. Let's learn how to write. Okay, so teacher do not know how to write in Korean, so I'm going to change it to English. To English. Okay, so you can click on it and it'll read to you. No? Okay, you're going to options in audio. You're going to turn Manaso on. 반갑습니다. Write it read to you. So what is it in English? It is nice to meet you. And you're going to click answer. 만나서 반갑습니다. Nice to meet you. And you can hear it. Read it to you. And then you're going to press any key to continue. Item. And you can hear it again. Item. Item. Which is name correct name item name name yes now you can do press any key to continue so if you don't know the answer you can click don't know this is my father it will tell you the correct answer and it's gonna tell you to copy so you're gonna look at this and type it out this is my father. 아버지. Good, and then you can just continue. And this is how much you have left. 10 questions. You got one wrong and two correct. You have 10 more to go. So you got bored. You want to go back and do something else. So then you're going to lose spell. You do you have a spelling? So you're going to type what you hear type what you hear you can go to options and i'm going to change it i'm going to answer with english with english okay this is my friend so what do you hear this is my friend this is my friend this is my friend so how do you write that in english this this is my friend period and then you're gonna click enter what's your name you can hear it again what's your name and again what's your name 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 oops what's your name enter teacher listen again teacher Listen again. Teacher. 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 Press enter. Name. Yeah, so that's how you're going to do your spelling practice. And then the last part of the studying is a test. So you can test yourself. Shiam. So just answer the questions and then you're going to come down here and check your answer. So brother, type it in Korean by clicking these. And then meet, friend, and then this is matching. You're going to match like A, B, C, type it in. Like, Uri Apaya, was it A, B, or C? A. This is my father. This is my father. B. This is my friend. This is my friend. C. What's your name? What's your name? So, number one is B. B, right? Number two, this is my friend. Father, good job. And then last one, three, C, what's your name? And then you're going to do multiple choice questions. Number one, mother. Mother. Which one is it? Mother, yes. And you're going to do all that. And then true or false. My name is Eric. My name is Eric. Ne chingu ya. Is it a match? Yes or no? If it matches, you will click true. If it don't match, 
you will click false. My name is Eric. Does it match? Nechunguya? No, so it is false. Number two, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Manaso bangapsamnida. Manaso bangapsamnida. Does nice to meet you match manaso bangapsamnida? Yes, it is true. It is the same meaning. It matches. Number three, teacher. Teacher. Song sang nim. Song sang nim. So is it the same? Yes, it is true. And then you can check your answer and it will tell you. Uh, yeah, I did it really bad because I skipped all those other ones. But yes. So you can go back and exit. So now after you completed your tests, your studying, you can play games. So the first game is called Match. Match. So we're going to click on Match and we're going to start the game. So first you're going to have a timer and you have to match the Korean to English or English to Korean. So what's your name? What's your name is right here. Name, name. My name is Eric. My name is Eric. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Sister, 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 father, father, father. Good. So then you can play again and try to do it faster than the time, than your time. So we're going to play again and try to go faster. Okay, this is my father. This is my father. Meet. 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 Friend. Friend. Teacher. Teacher. Brother. And name. Oh, still not. Did not beat the first place, which is me. Well, that's fine. You can play again or you can go to your next game. Exit. Your next game is Gravity. So now we're going to play Gravity. The game is called Gravity. So let's get started. You have to protect the planets from incoming asteroids. So I'm going to answer with English, but you can answer with Korean, English, or random. I will choose English. You can choose easy, medium, or hard. I will choose medium. So let's go. Start. Okay, so you're going to see this asteroid coming. In Korean, 내 친구야. In English, what is it? This. Ooh, this is my friend. I go. Yes. Okay. And then you're going to click enter. And the next one is. Yeah. My name is Eric. My name is Eric. And over here is your score and level. This is name. Enter. So, what is this in English? Teacher, good job. Teacher. This next one. Let's say you don't know the answer, so you just wait it and it comes down. Uh oh. Oh no, what's gonna happen? No, oh, nothing happens. Oh, so if you miss it, they're going to tell you in Korean and the cor correct answer in English. And you just have to type that word again. So just copy the word and copy and then you can do it again. 
And this one is Mana Soul Bangatsumi Bao, which is nice to meet you. And that is it for Quizlet. So don't feel like playing anymore. You can quit anytime. So let's just go back. And that is how you will use Quizlet to study for English. You can study and play games. Anyways, have a great day. See you next time.